This is fighter training workout legs. Get very familiar with the squat rack. This is where legs come from. All right. So you're gonna see that I put two weights here. This can be a two by four, this can be 10 pound weights, it doesn't matter. It could even be something like that. Just, I really like the heels elevated. You can also see that on leg day I'm wearing flats. This basically means there's no give in my shoes. That's big, okay? If you're swimming in your shoes, if you're in some really high-end uh, max airs or something, love those kind of shoes for training, but they're not great for legs. On a front squat, you're gonna keep your legs a little bit closer together and drop into it and come back down. You gotta try to break 90. Now you're gonna see my hand position, okay? Proper hand position is here, bringing it up with your elbows. So you're literally holding it like this. The idea is the weight sits on your shoulders. I don't have that luxury, I got a broken elbow. I literally broke the little bone that holds your elbow together off, so it hurts. You'll notice some of the, the variations I've done in my, in my workouts uh, for, for the arms fighter edition, I had to change because of my elbow. Now, because I do things, I have an injury. If you don't have this injury, do them the way that they're written, okay? But there are variations to, to account for those uh, real life situations. So as you see me grab this, this is my variation and it works very well for me and allows me to, to keep the weight in the proper position without feeling like my wrists and my elbows are gonna blow up. <sighs> now I will admit this is my very first set of the day. Just did a couple lunges, walking lunges to warm up, but I'm not warm and I'm sore as hell from earlier in the week, so. So, put my hands here. Turn on my dang heart rate monitor first. <sighs> Pop my shoulders. Think about what I'm about to do. Try not to kill my mic. Now, this weight is literally rested on my shoulders. I step back just a couple steps. Make sure my heels. Once again with the flats, I can actually feel the difference between the weight hitting my heel where it starts to stop, so I don't even have to look down to know I'm square. Now, I'm gonna try to look above. I'm gonna try to look at this mirror this whole time. Coaching over, let's go. One. Two. Three. Four. Now for fun, for all you fitness models out there, why don't you practice a little set at the end of your set. The set is a 10 second hold. You get on set, they ask you to do this. If you can't do it, they'll never call you back. Gives you an idea what I go through. One, two, three. Seven, six, five, four, come on, three, two, come on, come on. I made an ugly face. You gotta do that with a pretty face.